Hi kids! Hello, happy Monday morning again to you. How is everybody doing? I hope you're all feeling very happy that you're with your family and I hope that none is sick and I'm always very glad to know that you watch my videos because you know what? I miss you so much and I'm just just so glad and to know that you are safe in your homes. Now, have you been reading books lately? Hmm, I hope you've been reading. You know, the books I read this week would be our favorites, Pete the Cat, the one with the four groovy buttons, and Pete the Cat with his white shoes. So I'm gonna try to record that for you this week, okay? With lots of other books too. But I wanted to check if you are looking at your activity, weekly activity sheets, and if you're looking at the different um, ideas that are there. Do you know that this week, hmm, there was something there that talks about numbers and letters and having a game, like finding letters in your house. Like, can you find the letter A? Let's see, what's the letter A? Hmm, the letter A has two big lines and one short line, like this, like this, and one in the middle. I'll show you, huh? Like in this one, if I will write the letter A, it'll be big. See that line? Oh no. And another one, another big line, meaning at the end, and a short line. That's my letter A. So if you can go around and look in your house, oh, well, what are the letter A's there? Okay? And then about numbers, there's a number game. It says that you can write your numbers and then you can put them all over the floor and you can play some music or sing a song and then you're walking, walking, stepping on the numbers and when the music stops and your mommy says, freeze! Whatever number that you step on, you get to say, what number is that? Like this number, this is number one. There's one dot right there to remind you what that number is. And this number, number two, there are two dots, one, two. And this number, number three, one, two, three, and four, and five, and six, up to what number you want. You, you want just put one to five, Put it on your floor and then you can sing a song Well, you walk and you walk and you walk and you stop. And then you look at what number are you stepping on? And if you happen to be stepping on this number, what number is this? One, two, three, four, five, six. That's the number six and you say, I got the number six. Like that. So that's going to be a fun game. Just like looking for numbers, looking for letters, reading books and telling stories. All right, now, there's also something there about naming your feelings, and we know that, right? And about calming down when maybe things are getting too busy, or maybe you got a fight with your brother or sister, or maybe you just really wanted your mommy to do something for you, and then they're busy to do it, and you didn't want to wait. And you have some feelings you need to remember to calm down. All right, do you remember a calm down chant? You'll say, um, hands on your tummy and say, stop. Remember that, stop. And then you name your feeling. You say, I'm angry. Or you say, I'm sad. And then you take a belly breath. Can you take a belly breath with me? Like this. And again. We need to always remember to calm down. Sometimes we forget, okay? And relaxing is very important too. Now, just one more check. Have you been brushing your teeth? <laughs> I was gonna practice a brushing teeth song today. So I got a toothbrush right here. It's gonna practice with you, okay? Are you ready, are you ready? So first you're gonna brush your front teeth uh, all the way to the back like that. When you wake up in the morning and it's quarter to one and you want to have a little fun, you brush your teeth. You brush your teeth. And then you stop. 
And then you brush your insides ready when you wake up in the morning and it's quarter to two when you want to have something to do. You brush your teeth. You brush your teeth. Then you stop. And then you brush your upper teeth. Are you ready for your upper teeth? Upper teeth is up there again. Ah. When you wake up in the morning and it's quarter to three and your mind starts humming, twiddle dee dee, you brush your teeth. You brush your teeth. And then you stop. Remember your bottom teeth. Don't forget to reach the back part, okay? Like that. When you wake up in the morning and it's quarter to four and you hear someone knock on your door, you brush your teeth. You brush your teeth. And then you brush everywhere and then your tongue. When you wake up in the morning and it's quarter to five and you just can't wait to come alive, you brush your teeth. You brush your teeth. And then you brush your tongue. You brush your tongue. And then you stop. All right. Because brushing teeth is so very important. Just like washing your hands is so very important. So I don't want you to ever, ever forget that. All right. So I'm sending activities today to you. And I'm also sending a link to our Zoom meeting. I was hoping you could join me so that you can see me. And I can see you, or we can see some classmates that will join us in Zoom meeting on Wednesday at 2 o'clock. I'm sending the link. I hope you join us then. Okay, I'm looking forward to seeing all of you. I'm really, really very excited. We're just going to say hi to one another. Maybe sing a song. Maybe read a book. Okay, have fun. Have a great week. See you soon.